All right, so good morning. It's time for our book talk. It's book talk on Thursday, not Friday, because tomorrow is Good Friday. So you have off tomorrow and you have off Monday. So four-day weekend for you. So remember, no school tomorrow. Today's a good Thursday, though, because today we have... Brianna Salinas. <laughs> Brianna Salinas. And Brianna, what class are you from? Miss Strahan. Miss Strahan. And who's your reading teacher? Ms. Pacheco. Mr. Pacheco. Would you like to shout out to Ms. Strahan and Mr. Pacheco? No. <laughs> you don't want to shout out? Brianna, why don't you want to shout out to them? I don't know. I will shout out for you. On behalf of Brianna and myself, we would like to shout out to Ms. Strahan and Mr. Pacheco. You are awesome. If I looked up awesome in the dictionary, I would see your faces. <laughs> what was that, Brianna? Well, Brianna, Brianna said that she loves both of you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, that's, that's, that's good. That's good. She said very much. Very good. Brianna, what book are you reading? Crenshaw. Crenshaw. So this is what the book looks like. And it has a cat on it and a boy with a hat on, and it looks like they're staring off into the distance. What do you think they're thinking about when they look? See, they're like staring off in the distance. What do you think they're thinking about, Brianna? I'm um, not sure. Me either. The cat might be thinking, hmm, I'm kind of hungry. Maybe I should eat this boy. Well, that's his friend. That's his friend? Oh, okay. So you're going to tell me a little bit about it? All right. Tell me about this, this cat here. What's, first of all, what is, who, is, who or what is Crenshaw? Crenshaw is the big fat cat. And that's the little boy's imaginary friend. Oh, so the, that's the boy's imaginary friend is Crenshaw. And what does Crenshaw do? He helps them out when, when he's going through a rough time. When he has to live in his minivan for 13 years and Crenshaw was there to help him. That's pretty good. So have you finished reading the, the whole book? No, I'm almost done. Almost done? Do you like the book? Yes. Would you recommend the book to a friend? Yes. Is there a, you have a favorite part in the book? Um, when he's like in the bubble in the restroom and he's making bubbles and he has a like a beard made of bubbles, and then uh, he pops on. The cat or the 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 cat. The, the cat man. So the cat is is adventurous here, making bubbles and popping them. Does the cat get into trouble? No, not really. Does the boy get into trouble? No. Is there any other character that's an animal that's make-believe, like maybe the cat has a, a dog that he doesn't like? Oh, yeah, the little boy's dog, because him and his family have a dog named Aretha, and the cat doesn't like it. So. Yeah, the cat doesn't like it. My dog doesn't like my cat either. But no, my dog actually protects our cat. That's the crazy thing. If there's another cat, our dog goes crazy on that other cat to protect our cat but when they're together yeah they, they get along okay but it yeah it's not like they're <laughs> snuggly so if you had to take an AR test how many points would this book be three points three points excellent and the, by the way the author is Catherine Applegate and this is fantasy and it has a sticker on the spine of it and it's has a unicorn on it. A unicorn. You believe in unicorns? Yes. <laughs> really unicorns, yeah. I've seen a unicorn before. Have you seen a unicorn before? Yeah. A lot. A lot of unicorns, yeah. See, that's good. See? Imaginary friend. Instead of a cat, you can have a unicorn, you see? All right. Well, thank you for being on. High five. And here we go. We have... Mrs. Garza, Garza, Garza.
Good morning, Explorers. Today is Thursday, and it is a great day to be Explorers. Remember, Explorers, we are the best. We believe in ourselves, encourage others, strive for success, and take responsibility. Today, we want to recognize our Explorers of the Week who believe in themselves. We are very, very proud of these students. When you believe in yourselves, then you're going to naturally work harder and do better. So we are very proud of these students, and we want to recognize Joseph Flores. Congratulations, Joseph. Vianney Hernandez. Yay. Hector Chavez. Congratulations. And Meadow Mendoza. Congratulations. Congratulations to all these students. When they come back to your classroom or pod, make sure you give them a round of applause or a high five. Thank you. Yay. 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 Wave at the camera. Ah, ah. Wave at the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, 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 yes. Thank you. Yeah, so today we have um, a special announcement. We would like to say thank you to our APs, our assistant principals, Dr. Villarreal and Mrs. Alvarado. So if you see them in the hallway, give them a high five and tell them thank you for all the hard work that they do, not only to support us, but to support you as well, because a lot of the fun things that you're able to do you can't do because whatever reason you have them to thank for doing so fun days things like that say thank you to your ap's because they make a lot of the stuff that happens possible and you see them every morning if you go to the cafeteria for <laughs> breakfast by the way speaking of that uh you're going to see some you, some of you are going to see dr villarreal because she's in the library um for gt testing so teachers make sure you check your email for the list of kids that need to go to the library for GT testing. Um, she said she, she's going to send r runners to get those kids, so just be on the lookout for them. All right. Oh, this joke is from uh, Mr. Metter. This is from Mr. Metter. I didn't actually ask him if I could use this joke, but I'm going to use it. So, so this is from Mr. Metter. You know that dogs cannot do scans what? dogs dogs cannot do scans but cats scan cats can cat scan cat scan cat dogs 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 can't do scans but cats can like a cat scan you go get a cat scan of your body cat scan mm-hmm mm -hmm. yeah thank mr matter for that thank you mr matter you see Look, look, see, you're, 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 she's, you're laughing, she was laughing uncontrollably. You're laughing, you're, she was laughing uncontrollably just then. You see, you see, she's laughing uncontrollably, you see. Thank you. Until tomorrow. No, until Tuesday.